hello my pretties we're here checking on what is going on in the spirit world you guys do know that as above so below so what's happening right now with the soulmates and round and round okay um there's a whirlwind there's going to be a tornado and it's going to go to a specific place there's going to be some sort of natural disaster it's going to go to a specific place and it's going to round up some troops okay um this may look like a nat natural disaster and there may be um you know some people who go down with it whatever it is it could be a flood it could be anything right um i'm being told that we gonna be feel sorry for them but they not to be felt sorry for okay um it's just the order of operations it is just divine law that is happening here with the round and round and soulmates there's gonna be things that have been put out that's gonna come back to people okay this is the energy that we're that we're working with the reason why i do these reads every now and then what's going on in the spirit world is because i feel like for those of you that do any type of manifestation work spell work um prayers okay anything i feel like when we're doing work it should align with the with the energies that are um currently going on in the spirit world because as above so below so i would do things to support um what spirit say and what spirit is doing at the time and right now justice is being served people are getting what it is that they deserve okay and there are also some knives that are coming out of other people's backs there are heal there is healing here um one of the things that i want to let you guys know is that and i know y'all know already but i'm just going to reiterate it that karma is not bad karma is not bad okay karma is not bad Karma's a bitch. They say that, but karma's only a bitch if you're a bitch to her. Karma is what you are to her. Okay? You ain't did shit. You ain't got nothing to be worried about. Okay? It's, it's like, it's kind of like a, you know, um, it's not like cause and effect. You know, this is more than that. Okay? Because some people, you know, have been doing this. It, God gives a lot of warnings and stuff like that. God is very, very forgiving. You know? And that's why I say, you know, God's energy is very feminine because it's very, very, very forgiving. Okay. <clears throat> Motherly, right? So some, some people's asses got to get spanked. All right. And this may be detrimental. Um, there's going to be, oh, I just died in your arms tonight. It must have been something you said. I just died in your arms tonight. Somebody's going to die in another person's arms. And in particular, what's going to be going on with that person is they're, go they're going to be uh, bleeding from the neck. Whatever that means. Oh, I just died in your arms tonight. It must have been something you said. I just died in your arms tonight. Whatever energy people put out, they're going to be getting back with this soulmate energy. Lessons, okay? Oh, my God. <laughs> y'all, when y'all be hearing me say, I say that a lot, right? I be getting mad and I shouldn't. I get annoyed with knowing things when it's my job okay but i don't like how i know something Some, there's a man here that's uh, um somebody name may be raw but there's a man here because i'm hearing i want to rock right now i'm raw based i came to get down i'm not internationally known but i'm known to rock the microphone and and i'm and i'm hearing it takes two to make a thing go right it takes two to make it on side I don't know what that means. It takes two to make a thing go right. Somebody could be coughing up blood. There could be a couple here that's going to learn a, a very valuable lesson around you specifically. There's a, there's a female oh, child. It's about the things that people have done for success. There's, success. there's always going to... There's also going to be people, somebody got a speech impediment. There's also going to be people that um are unaliving themselves. These are people that have been doing nefarious things. Um, 
Yeah, I, I was about to say, I don't like when I be knowing certain stuff, but I got to thank God for my gifts. But anyway, there is a man out here who is passing on spiritually transmitted diseases or sexually transmitted diseases. And he going to have a disorder with his blood. Hit it. I don't want to rock right now. I don't want to rock right Somebody's going to be picking a lock for some reason. It's so funny because wisdom just came out. Stay away from me if you're contagious. I heard, I heard, um, all right, because now I'm getting, I got two opposite sides of my brain working. I, now he's saying, ladies love me. Girls adore me. I mean, even the ones that never saw me like the way that I rhyme at a show. The reason why, man, I don't know. So let's go. This person could be saying I'm a player. Now they starting to talk about, um, this other song with Vibes Cartel where he talks about um, I love you till time end but Tanisha pregnant again may never mean to you have to believe me another girl gonna have my baby somebody's gonna unalive themselves because they here cause, she, cause he said she tell me if I get, get a next youth she gonna chuck it out of the river and she can't swim so there's a threat to unalive themselves because they find out that somebody else is pregnant or something like that. Somebody's mind is lost. <sighs> yeah. Oh my Lord, there's another person that... I'm not going to say it. I don't want to say it, so I'm not. I don't have to. People, is gonna, people out here is going to get hurt. That's all I can say. People out here that's going to get hurt. Hold on, y'all. There are people out here. That's going to get themselves hurt. Okay. It's, it's about what they did for money. Look at this. Love in transition. Yeah, my battery died at that last. Um... Yeah, so. um, This could even be a couple here that may pass away, you guys. It could be a couple. It, 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 but this is not. This is. This is what I'm tapping into specifically. But this is not specific at all. This is a. Um. A worldwide thing. This is a worldwide thing. I hate when they do this to me. I don't hate it, but I just don't like when they do this to me. They make me want to sing everything. Oh, if I was a rich girl, because it's relevant. Somebody did something being to be rich. And they may pass away as a couple. Two people. That's why I was hearing it takes two to make a thing go right. There could be a person that may pour out their heart to you before they go because they know something is wrong. Yeah. Look at look at this. We have the two of cups in reverse. We have the two of cups in reverse. This is a breakup. Somebody, show me wisdom. Show me wisdom. Yeah, somebody's going to be honest with another person and let them know, like, that they've been dealing with um, two separate people or, or other people. Yeah, they're going to lay down a law, spill the beans in some way. Somebody's going to feel betrayed by it. But this, this, with this, it takes two to make a thing go right. This has a lot to do with pairs of people or groups of people that were involved in something. And I'm feeling like, you know, it is specific. To somebody, there could be a person here that travels for work, maybe a trucker or something like that. Somebody that works with their hands or something. They travel for work. What did I say? Look at them. Okay. It says um they could they could bury stuff for a living or do um gardening or something like that. This is about what people did for profit. Okay. 
Look at this, parenthood. I told you this is groups. And then I told you, I love you till time end. But Tanisha, pregnant again. Me never mean to. You have to believe me. I, I'm hearing, I'm feeling the energy of secrets coming out as well. But somebody could be going ahead telling their own secrets. One person got a tattoo of the other person's name or both or something like that. This, this, somebody could be telling another person that they got a whole nother family that this person was blind to. And it's going to cause another person to have stress. And look, look what I said about the, what did I say about the um, unaliving of themselves? She said, if I catch a ne next youth, she go chucking out a river and she can't swim. This is her thinking about it. This is her getting ready on your mark to set dive, okay? Because she's overloaded and overstressed. Somebody is going to find out that someone got a whole other family or that, you know, this is about to be, this is some drama that's going to transpire with people in particular, okay? That's what I want to say. This is a particular situation, all right? Um, and it has to do with, there's gonna there's a lot of couples that have been involved. So a lot of you guys, you know, we've been picking up, um, look, it's love at the bottom of the deck. Uh, we've been picking up that there are a lot of karmic couples, okay? Oh, wow. So Spirit just said to me, we're, 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 we're breaking up a lot of karmic couples because we have to have room for the, um, kingdom spouse couples also and then also because we don't want no more karmic babies is what's being said Child. wow 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 ideation this is about lies i just heard mishaps mishaps mistakes lies chaos uh, people living in lies being happy about lies okay doing things for clout um, uh, uh, people living a lie, all right? There's going to be a lot of things that gets exposed, especially as it pertains to relationships. Now, listen, the thing about this is you don't have to be a karmic, uh, to be in a karmic relationship. You could just be in a karmic relationship and there could be lies exposed about you, who you're dealing with so you can be with the person that you need to be with. God ordained spouse is what I just heard. So you may be finding something out about somebody just so you could go where you need to be. We, we Look, be here now. Look at this. So we have a water sign and a fire sign energy. So um, there's going to be in, in, intense emotions. I'm hearing demands. Okay. Like this, you could be um seeing yourself in a in a fight with somebody. There's going to be with the Ten of Pentacles. It feels like the breakup of families based on lies. And it is because God is making room for healthy families. Yes, what did, I, what did I say with the spirit family? What did I say? This is for you to be with the person that you're supposed to be with. This doesn't only have to do I, I just, with relationships because I just heard partnerships as well. This is friendships, everything. Partnerships that are not divine are going to be excluded and deleted, okay? So that you can have the real Ten of Pentacles, a foundation based, based on truths rather than lies. Your, 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 your spirit is wanting you to shine and meet your real spirit family and healthy relationships that nourish your soul, okay? And not make you feel like... Okay, they telling me that there's a person here that I'm speaking to, that there's a person who made you fat purposely. Okay, I don't want to say fat. I'm going to say unhealthy. I'm going to say unhealthy. But they were trying to feed you, overfeed you. Like this person, I heard clouded judgment. It felt like this person wanted you to be on their level. And so they wanted you like, this could be a person that want, that always wants you to smoke with them or always wants you to drink with them, something like that. It doesn't have to do with weight because you could be real skinny messing with this person. They could be uh, um, telling you you're too fat or something like that. This has to do with someone wanting to bring you down to their level, okay? By way of unhealthiness, even stress, stressing you out because they don't want you to become privy to the fact that you don't need them and you don't need to be with them. But this energy of transition and love, like I said, spirit is breaking, breaking down no relationships so you could get into less relationships. Yes, relationships. I'm sorry, because somebody, a lot of people are in relationships and 
know, there's somebody in there wearing a mask. But then this also goes for those karmic couples that we be picking up that do magic together, unalive people together, still energy together, um, hail Steven together, still, uh, 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 what I'm about to say, scam. Look at this. King of Cups and Lies, keeping you in the dark. Spirit is breaking down all of this. Whether it's Queen of Cups, King of Cups, whoever is using emotions to lie to you or you are being emotionally manipulative. Yes, the Emperor in reverse. Like I said, demands. This is somebody who feel like, not somebody, but this is an archetype who feel like they could tell you what to do and they could um, command and demand your ass. They telling me somebody working with a commanding candle. That's another thing too. Uh, I ain't gonna say it. I ain't even gonna say it. Show me this emperor. Emperor making false promises purposely. That's that emotionally uh, manipulative energy. This person is, is the type of person that'll boss you around and you don't even know you're getting bossed around. Step on you, stepping all over you, dominating you and you don't know. That's that kind of manipulative energy. Listen, if, if you're dominating me, please let me know. Is this what we doing? Because I'll try anything twice. <laughs> Word. I'll try anything twice. But 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 to emotionally manipulate me into getting dominated? Like, this is like somebody who, um, will, 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 when you stand up for yourself or, or when you try to confront them about something, they start playing the violin and shit. This is a narcissist is what it feels like. I just heard Pisces. Yeah, this is this is to dominate you. This person wants to win over you. What's this idea? They're also telling me that this is yeah, that this is um this is about men who are um how you say it? These are like the womb raiders getting taken down. The men that are trying to um sacrifice women's and women's energy the energy of women okay this has to do with that too you see this energy of gold and nightmare this is someone who's targeting someone who they feel like is unprotected or of lesser than them or whatever the case is what did i say false promises this is some this is a a, a, a person who's trying to use a man a, i mean the a woman or somebody who they feel like is low this is misogyny this is a breakdown of misogyny as well. There's somebody that's going to catch their lover doing something. Um, it's not funny. Um, on camera too. This is somebody who's going to catch their lover doing something on camera. A camera, a, a home camera or some shit like that is going to catch them. Or somebody going to catch them. Some, some type of recording device is going to catch someone. And they're going to get caught out there. I hate you so much right now. There's a physical battle that's going to happen. And this may result in someone being C-U-T. Okay? At the very least, somebody close is going to get ripped from a sword. Okay? There's magic that's being used, secrets about magic being used to cloud another person's intuition and make them dumbfounded. This is what's coming out. And this is to stop their growth, put, put, a, put a death, uh, a, a stop, uh, transform their growth, period. This is, this is what I'm speaking about. But, but it's by way of stealing it, though. These are energy vampires. That are all going down. And uh, there's a lot of um, emphasis being put on male energies or or uh, people that are in a, collabor a collaboration, you know, that are trying to eat off of the person they're collaborating with. These are karmic relationships that are stopping your success. Divine one success. People, period, success. Okay? And they're going to be put a stop to. And I'm telling you right now, body's going to drop. Because spirit saying, I done told y'all. What if God was one of us? Just a slob like one of us. 
Just a stranger on the bus trying to make his way home. Yeah. These are hateful individuals that I'm picking up. Okay? Hateful in individuals. So this, this card came out. Happiness. I am aware that being happy means that I'm on the right path. Yeah, these are, this is karmic relationships. Karmic friendships. Karmic family members. All that stuff. If the person not making you happy, what are you there for? What are you there for? Because the person using magic on you to make you dumb, deaf, and blind. With the magic intuition and space, like I said earlier. Wow. There's, there's, a, there's a message here about a person flushing, flushing another person's chakras like flushing them like literally like to bring all that energy to them god is saying so they could profit off of it and this could, could be through sex or chakra manipulation or sex magic tapping energy manipulation whatever mm -mm 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 -mm. i want to expand my consciousness and awareness this is going to be especially for people that are choosing to walk the path of the most high that are going to be getting this justice. But I'm telling you right now. I just died in your arms tonight. It must have been something you said. I just died in your arms tonight. That may happen. Okay. Not literally. But maybe literally for somebody. But also figuratively. You may be in a karmic relationship. And you may be dumb, deaf, and blind to it. And something may happen to your karmic partner. Period. Because that's probably the only thing that, that was going to keep them away from you. And once you chose to walk in the path of God, you have to understand when God removed people around you by any means necessary. You want to know why? Because you was too dumb, deaf, and blind. And that's okay because we've all been there. No judgments. But you was too dumb, deaf, and blind to remove them yourself. But when you chose to walk the path of God and you uh, allow God to intercept and intercede by choosing that path, then you allow God to come in and take out the trash. However, in whatever way, we have <laughs> not for you. And to be fair, this person is not for you. You could be married to this person. You could have been in a contract with this person, some sort of legally binding thing or, you know, uh, had a house with them, a baby with them, something that binded you to them. They could have did binding spells on you. Person got to go. Somebody, you got this person name tattooed on you. Somebody, wow, they said somebody in denial. They're imagining that they're happy. You're not, when you know, he said, so why, oh, why, oh, why, oh, why, oh, why, oh, are you so in denial when you know you're not happy there? Hey, oh, oh, oh. Hey, uh, oh, don't want to meet your daddy. He said, don't want to meet your mama. Just want to make you come up. That this is somebody who just, okay, wants instant gratification. They just want something from you. That's it. And I'm just being honest. This person is not being I'm honest. I'm just being honest. He says that in that song. Somebody could be proposing that they want to have a family with you, so on and so forth. When they just a uh, uh, sex magic magician, or they just a uh, energy vampire, or they just want money, or they just want sex, or they just want drugs, or they just want rock, rock and roll. Everybody's looking for something. They saying after this, you're going to be in an energy where you feel bad for not listening. But you cannot change the past. And that's what happens when God got to bring the tower. Listen, when you sign up to walk in the path of God... And, and, and you don't heed warnings that God give you, then when the tower comes, because it's always dun, 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 when the tower comes, it's like, I, I wouldn't have had to bring the tower if you would have heeded the other 357 warnings that I had gave you when I gave them to you, but you didn't. Now you looking fool. Because I done made the fucking house uh, burn up and burn down so you couldn't be with this person. I done made this person, literally, I'm, I'm hearing this, y'all. I literally, I'm, I'm hearing, I done made this person's visa expire or something go wrong with their visa. So they got to go back to their country so that you can't deal with them. I wouldn't have had to have did that like that had you heeded the warning in the first place.
Y'all don't listen. Somebody don't listen is what I'm hearing. No judgments. What did I say? Accident and mask. I told you. Why did I have to take it this far? Some of y'all, it's like spirit has to stop this person before you hurt yourself. Dealing with them before they hurt you. So if something catastrophic happened, you brought it on yourself. I don't mean no harm, y'all. But I'm, 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 y'all know I'm real. Like, and I've been here. So again, no judgments. Because some people don't like the truth. Word. Some people don't like the truth. It's threatening to, 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 to what they want to believe. And somebody's in denial here. So now something catastrophic is going to have to happen. The hammer's going to have to, the devil's going to have to be banged. The hammer's going to have to come down because people ain't listening. Somebody around you wearing a mask. What did I say? Loss. What did I say? Somebody going to look, somebody might lose the person. Somebody, another person might go to jail. This person might put their fucking hands on you or something like that to make you to maybe a restraining order. There's going to be things. And this don't even have to be for you guys. This is, like I said, this is a universal energy. You're going to be seeing a lot of stuff go down. Stay out the way, y'all. I heard get out the way, yo. Get out the way, yo. Biggie Smalls just got dropped. Pass the mech and let him hit him. No. I know that there's no greater goal than to love, okay? Some of you guys are going to be in a low vibration after this happens for a little while. Y'all, what I said, fear. I realized that I'm testing my resolve to live in the energy of love. Your fear and, and, and your denial and your low vibrational energy about this person, about this situation is going to stop you from success. Somebody, some of y'all are afraid of being alone, or some people are afraid of being alone. And I meant to say that earlier. It's like so, 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 so. <laughs> it's not funny. Um, but it's like you pick the devil that you know. Rather than saying, I'm not accepting no devils at all. Some people are going and picking the devil that they know instead of saying, like, I don't do devils. Okay? I I I walk, I walk with God. I don't do devils. I walk with the most high. You can't line devils up and I choose the one that I know that I've known for years. Oh, give me that one. I'm not choosing at all. Y'all can have all that shit. I'll be by myself. I'll be alone. But that does not mean that I will be lonely. For some of y'all, the, the uh, people that you keeping around you or a person that you sleeping with or, or whatever the case is that you holding on so tight to is bad for your health anyway. So God is like, excuse me. I'll take it from here since you don't want to do what I told you to do. We could have did this shit amicably. So. Look, we have the energy of discipline. God is going to do it since you fa well, failed to have the courage to do it. You didn't take enough pride in your own self to d release the person. Surrender them. Look, come on now. Come on now. You, you was given the messages with the balance here. With patience, you, 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 you failed to change it. You failed to change it. You was procrastinating. You gave up your peace. And you gave up being honest with yourself. You know you wasn't supposed to deal with that person. You felt guilty about it. But you didn't listen. So now, the person got to be removed. And you're going to think it's bad news, but it's good news, though. So many... They saying this person got a spell on you. I put a spell on you because you're mine. I put a spell on you. Well, y'all come about this. Y'all, y'all gonna be okay. Look, I put a spell on you. This person is telling you what to think and how to act. Little do you know, using you as a puppet. This is not for everybody. This is for everybody. You hear what I'm saying? This is not for all of y'all, but this is for everybody. This is general, okay? This can even be your past. But this was a, something um, that needed to be said, y'all. Again, I've been here. There's a lot of flushing energy. There's a lot of flushing energy. Yeah, you guys are all this. You're overwhelmed because you will not surrender and take action to surrender to things. 
that 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 you need to change and build a new life. You're literally keeping yourself from celebration. Let me tell you something. If you are holding on to something in your life that 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 is making you um that's bringing you down and you and you trying to follow God or you trying to be on, on a spiritual path or whatever the case is and you holding on to something purposely holding on to something that you have knowledge of that you've been warned several times about. If you if you holding on to that shit, that means you you're, you're sacrificing yourself, sacrificing your happiness. Sacrificing your true journey, living in your truth, sacrificing your your uh, your honesty, integrity of what you know to be right or what you know to be true. To be with somebody who's stealing from you energetically, physically, emotionally for what? God going to handle that. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Let me tell you something. My awakening was so aggressive. I said, God, what did I do to you personally? Because that was personal. God said, you ain't did shit to me. It's what you was doing to yourself. It's what you was doing to yourself. I want you to do this over here. I got something planned for you. You know it's it, it, it's, it's better things than this, what you're doing here. And so since you ain't want to give it up, I'm going to take it from you in the most horrible way possible okay when i tell you i was slapped out my coma or, or with the spell somebody had me under i was bow slapped out my coma i was like damn that wasn't nice we have the sun if you need to take spiritual baths go on a pretty oracle.com y'all take spiritual baths read books go get an animal okay find something to do with yourself Journey to love. Look at that. The sun journey and woman holding a heart. This is to put you back on your journey. Like I said, you're supposed to be healing people. What are you doing? What are you doing? This is for somebody. What are you doing? You're supposed to be healing people. This is for a lot of people that's supposed to be healers. This is about God ain't got time for this shit. You know what I'm saying? And so he, God is coming to fix this because at the end of the day, it's just like, I, I need y'all to, to, to assist me in the transference of power from evil to good. Okay. And a lot of y'all is in karmic relationships, doing karmic shit, uh, anything that's karmic that you're doing. And I have to break that up off you, whatever this, it, it, it could, it could even be something that's on your back, a negative spirit or entity that's on your back. It, God's sending it with, 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 da, 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 but he also sending it with healing. Because this is the energy you're going to end up in. Look, love. This is the energy you're going to... God saying yeah, everything that I took, I take, I'm going to replace it. I am. But I'm going to replace it with better and your true path. It's because God need us to do something. Look, put this one by the 44, 144,000. Okay? I tell you no lies. I need y'all to wake up. He, he like, I need y'all to wake up. Y'all doing karmic shit and karmic relationships and stuff like that. And I got I got a plan for y'all. I need y'all help. So let me get that dude you holding on to. Because he ain't shit. <laughs> let me get that bum bitch that you keep pacifying and doing shit for. Because she keep crying every time you're trying to leave her. Even though you know she a karmic. Let me get that help. Let me get that. Let me get them drugs that you feel like you got to keep doing. Let me get that childhood trauma. Let me get that family member that you keep dealing with because you want to respect your elders, but you know this person is a is a is a bitch out of hell, okay? Respectfully, because they're elder, respectfully a bitch out of hell. The big duppy of the family. Let that person go. Why this person holding you down? These, these are karmic relationships that needs to come down and break down. And that's what spirit is doing. And I really hope that helps. I love y'all.